Hey there everyone, this is Vembrandt, and welcome back to What the Heck Am I Doing Central. Um, in the last episode, we uh, basically uh, ran around the Land of Darkness blind. We, um, how do you say, um, we managed to get pretty damn far. I got a new weapon, Chakra the Chakram, which is basically a light disc of death. But I only have two bullets, and if I don't catch it back, well, I don't know where I can get more. But apart from that... <laughs> what I want to do first is head down to the Temple of the Sun and see if Mulbrook has something, anything new to say with uh, this advancement. Because she's the only one that's gonna give me proper clues about the world. You've been living in the ruins for quite some time now. Are you able to read the Lamulana script without the help of a device? Easiest. The numbers are the easiest. Each number has its own meaning. Zero is nothing. One is beginning. Four is death. And five is rebirth. Six is war. Seven is deceit. Eight is eternity. And nine is ascension. I can't remember who two and three. Oh, that's the maximum, eh? Hmm. So wait. Let me check that out again. So, zero is nothing. Okay, one is the beginning. Two probably would be, um... <sighs> would be life. Three would be um, to grow old. Four would be death, and then you are reborn on the fifth one, on the fifth day. On the sixth day is war. On the seventh is to deceive. Eight is eternity, and nine is ascension. Is does she has anything else to say? Okay, she doesn't say anything new. Because also all those, um, uh, how'd you call them, um, all those tablets that I want to go read, but I don't know how to get to them. Hmm. What's over there again? So wait. There's nothing to the left. Okay, this is getting a bit curious, sir. Statue of the Giant. A statue of the Giant waits in the land of Inferno. The word of the spirits are within, hidden within. One must wait for them to present, present themselves. Okay, so if I go to the Inferno, Land of Inferno, well, the Inferno Caverns, and I go next to that uh, statue of a woman and wait for a while, will I get something? And there's that thing up there that always brings me... Oh! Ajanta Caves! Resemble the stupa of India Ajanta Cave. The centerpiece seems to be a statue of a goddess with a snake body. Okay. So I'm gonna go see that... I'll keep an eye in case there's an actual giant's body somewhere. And I feel like... Like, there's that game that I can buy or whatever. And I feel like they wouldn't give it to me for no reason. So let's go check it out. Yeah, you. I really hope I didn't waste money. Alright. 
You get those first flash game, twist, turn, and spin as you navigate your ship around a planet. Now, how do I use it? Oh yeah, there's also this. Oh no, yeah, I already used that. Um, hmm. Unfortunately, fire doesn't do anything to me anymore. Because there's plenty of statues in the background here, but I don't think they're the ones I'm looking for. The princess is in another castle. So yeah, this is the only giant, I guess, giant statue that I know of. So if I, first of all, I'm gonna kill everything. Turn left, swing your, yeah. I can't go behind her, so there's something behind her. What if I stay behind her head for a tiny bit? I really hope I do get something out of this because I'm still at a loss on where I can go in this ga goddamn game. Mm hmm. Being patient here. Why is she so solid? Whip. Whip hits a bit farther, maybe I can hit whatever trigger I'm looking for. It says there's something above. Hmm. There's n Oh, wait. Is there a way to go up there from here? Okay, there's nothing here. I fell. Come on, I was swinging. Ah. Well, anyway, it's a uh, moment of discovery right now. Can't activate that. I'm gonna say you're raged. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be a way for me to go somewhere out here. Yeah, this place gives me a nice sense of urgency, but it doesn't help me in knowing where to want the heck I'm going. Is that place I can get stuck in? Oops, I fell. God, oh man. Did I ever go over there? Okay, wait. I'm gonna head back. I'm gonna buy some weights and um, check out what's uh, past all those barriers. I don't remember those barriers at all. Yes, thank you, young lady. Ta ta. Um, ba -da 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 -da. All right, heal up. And apparently, there's also hot springs in the um, in the dungeon. Well, in the ruins. I feel it's faster to go from here, though. I need to do some uh, shenanigans with uh, jumping and stuff, but...
There. I find it strange also that there's no statue of Isis in Isis's chamber. But that's not important right now. Like that. Up. Up. And we got all the way here with minimum hurt. Let's try to go pa around quickly. There we go. Made it. Okay, first of all, what does this have to say to me? Oof. Reveal the light to the grieving twins. Reveal the light to a world destroyed. The hero comforts light upon the twins as they hold up the world. Alright, so basically the weights allow me to get here without getting hurt as much. Oh no, never mind. It was a trap. Okay. Now I know, let's go back to heal. Because just in case there's a boss at the end of this, I would prefer um, to be uh, fully, as fully healed as I can be once I get there. So in other words, I need to, I need to pay the toll to get uh, to where I want to be. up there ah damn it <sighs> uh, still no go I wish I had a way to uh, jump off walls or whatever that um that stone told me in the Infernal Cavern. Like, apparently you can kick off a wall. Ugh, went too far. Ah. <laughs> Trying to go quickly, but the game is not allowing me to. There we go. Ugh. Let's not waste any time. Come on, like the page didn't the <laughs> the room didn't even fully load and I got attacked. Is there anything for me up here? I can't go in there, right? Yeah. Well, whatever. But gotta make sure I don't miss this. Nice. There we go. Oh! Ugh. Ha! Five witches plus one more will gather. At the at which point Baphomet will be summoned. No. I will not fall into that trap. Oh wait. It's it's mirroring. <gasps> yes. 
Behold the twin's labyrinth. The soul of the twin dwells here. New content. Da -da 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 -da. And you see that symbol on it on the back. Statue of Buranun. A statue of tw of twins. Said to be the last surviving descendants of the first child. On their back is an etching of the number three in the script of La Mulana. Would tree mean the world? Would it mean balance? Would it mean support? There's a lot of possibilities. The Big Brother shop is much more exclusive. It's for more exclusive clientele. The Little Brother shop is for regulars. Oh, I see shop over there. The power to stop time for thine eyes only will time flow. Even things too quick to be seen will become visible. And also that is a badass mural in the background. Dolphin combat vehicle. A mural depicting a combat vehicle being pulled by dolphin. Uh, anyway, I need to be able to stop time to get into that shop. Oh, duh. that's different. Poseidon? A statue of Poseidon. Resemble Poseidon, the god of the sea from Greek mythology. The design does not belong to any known civilization. I need to bring water here? I guess that could be an option, but I don't have that ability right now. Okay, wait. Let's uh, go heal up. I want to randomly die uh, while running around these corridors. Na, 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 na. Bomb. Ah. I'm gonna go check check up on Mulbrook again uh, quickly. See what's up. If there's anything new uh, up with her. I'm really glad there's no uh, fall damage in this game. A moving floor in the twin labyrinth that doesn't move. I believe it was the third children that created those those ruins. The third children had wings. You know, they were about as smart as me, and figured out a way to make floating floors. They wouldn't need that if they had wings. Perhaps it'd fall into disrepair, as it is old. Stomping on it might help. Stomp on it high above, and maybe it'll move. Now, then Mulbrook will go back to sleep. Okay. So I need to stomp on it. But where's the moving floor? I don't remember seeing it. Unless it's the one below Poseidon. Where is it? Wait a second, where is it? Done. Bring the sky, Inferno. But I read it! Oh my god, really? I need to get back there on foot? Okay. Whatever. No, that's a darkness area. Ah. Oh, that was a. That was quite the mistake. By the way, let's uh, let's not dwell on it and just get back there. I know how to get it, get to it.
I guess there's a limit to the amount of, um... Screw you. Okay. I hate those Gibbon. Gibbon... I think that's what they are, at least. I don't know my primates uh, as much as I wish I, I did. Are they primates or are they, are they just apes? Uh, thank you for the... The weight, at least it saves me one. I don't want to go down there just in case it traps me. And welcome to... Ouch! Mirror Town. I'm already almost dead, that's the worst part of it. Okay, now, why did you not... I'll save again. I'll read it again. It does not get saved, huh? Oh, well, we all know what that means. We've gotta be freaking careful. Okay, that platform in question doesn't seem to be around here. Uh, I still got hit. Ah, oh, damn it! Really, I fell off. Okay, it worked. Oh, you're a skeleton too, huh? There. Yes. But that's not what I want right now. I want to check what's down here. Temple of Moonlight? Okay, no, I'm not ready to go to the Temple of Moonlight. I'm almost gonna get some healing from uh, those green orbs. So I won't need to uh, run back home for uh, survival. I'll get this. Yes! Let me shank you! Oh, I thought that was a platform. <laughs> anyway, it's a vertical scroll, so they shouldn't, shouldn't uh, respawn up there. Right, bring me up. What's waiting for me at the top? Better not be another Chimera. I guess it's a type of Chimera. Looks a lot easier to deal with, though. I just need uh, the right moment to strike. You know what? I'ma uh, shoot you! Ah, oh, damn it! Oh, come on, seriously! And also, I missed another bullet. Uh. 
Ah. Okay, but... It looked a hell of a lot easier to deal with than, um... The other one. Perfect. Like that. No, that's not good. We're running low on time here. You know what? They respawned on the from the other side, huh? Let's see if I can uh, farm this guy for uh, green orbs. Yes, I can. Because I'm almost there anyway, so don't make me fall. Because if I can get that green orb, that green orb heal plus go back and save, I'll be perfect. And activate the, um, what do you call it, the lift would be a plus. I missed. Oh really? Did, does it know that I'm uh, farming it now? All chops. That's not what I expected. What am I? Ugh. Ooh. Oh, I'm not gonna complain about that. Almost there. There's a teensy tiny bit left. Teensy tiny bit. Okay. Yes. And finally, just go back to save. And before the episode end, I'm gonna do another attempt on that uh, flying goat. <sighs> okay, I got scared I would miss my shot. All right, let's do this attempt now. First of all, you go away. There we go. Oh, yeah, 2 HP is uh, not a big deal. Ah, got way too close. Like that. Yes. Because it doesn't stop in some weird, awkward place. Hmm, one of them survived. Okay, I'm out of bullets. Yes! I did it! I did it! Oof. 
Uh, I'm not trusting that place. Oh no, there's witches! Wait, is this a cul-de-sac? Did I do this? Did I seriously do this? Because that looks like a hole I could enter. And there's two brothers up there. Yeah. What's the point of this then? Hmm. Well, anyway, we're gonna stop things here, guys. Um, I managed to <laughs> get my uh, kill the, the mini boss, although at the expense of my all my bullets, unfortunately. Yeah. Um. Now I'm gonna explore uh, that part of the Twin Labyrinth. What I hate is that, for some reason, I'm not allowed to teleport there. But I'm gonna have to deal with that, really. <laughs> ah, there we go. Fully invigorated. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. And I'll see you all in the next chapter of La Mulana.